Yeah, we'll go live in a bit, Chip. In three, two. We're live. All right, good evening. I'm Executive Assistant Chief Larry Satterwhite. We are out here at 7700 Riptide on a family violence uh, call where the suspect fired on our officers as they arrived. Uh, we're still gathering information, but I'll tell you what, you, what we know. The good news, I'll tell you right up front, uh, is our officers were not injured, thankfully. Uh, there was a female uh, inside the house along with a male suspect and also two children under the age of 10. Uh, I'm happy to report that the female and the two children were released and were not harmed, with the exception of the female who was assaulted by the male uh, at, prior to and what was the source of this call. So uh, a few more details, at 8.34 p.m. tonight, uh, we received a call for a domestic violence, a, a disturbance with a weapon, a female screaming for help. Our officers arrived at eight, uh, or we got the call at 8.35 and our officers arrived within one minute. They walked up to the house uh, to where this, where this was going on and started knocking on the door and immediately started taking fire from inside the house through the door towards our officers. Our officers backed up set a perimeter, immediately went to calling out, to making uh, uh, voice commands, trying to establish a com uh, communication with the suspect. Um, and then right after that, thankfully, uh, the female and the two children were released. However, unfortunately, the, the uh, male suspect who started all this uh, made statements that he was not coming out, he was not going to surrender, uh, alluding to it may end up in a gunfight or a further gunfight and, and uh, with him uh, not surrendering or being uh, willing to uh, be uh, taken into custody tonight. Uh, our SWAT was called, our h &T was called, our officers did a fantastic job setting up a perimeter around the uh, location. Once we got the female uh, and the two children out, uh, then it was a time just to negotiate with the suspect and try to get him to, uh, to comply and surrender without anybody else getting hurt. Um, over the course of about an hour to two hours, maybe a little bit longer, um, officers engaged in, uh, in negotiation. I will tell you, one of them was our very, a very young officer, just, just on the streets, just off probation, and did a phenomenal job until our other negotiators arrived and took over. And ultimately, the, the suspect did surrender. Uh, he is a 39-year-old male. The female is a 36-year-old uh, female. The, the two children are nine and eight, with female and male. And again, like I said, uh, we have a lot of resources on the scene because that's what we do to try to make everything safe. Our dinner officers did a great job and we're just thankful nobody was seriously injured. Questions? Mm -hmm. No questions, Chief. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you very Chief. much, right. Chief. All right. Go. All right, there we go. What's up with it, Hoodnies Peeps? It's your girl, Grizzy. Scene is just wrapping up. We're here at these. Hey, how are you doing, sir? Thank you, sir. You too. We're here at the 7700 block of Riptide. It was going down tonight, y'all. Thank y'all. We had a man barricaded in the house. They got him, though. They got him. He had assaulted his uh, lady. The children are okay. Shots were fired on his behalf. Nobody was injured, including himself. Everybody makes it home safe, you know, and uh, person's in custody right now at this time. They do have resources out here. As you guys saw, look like we had some of our SWAT members out here. They were able to quickly, uh, you know, assess everything. Shout out to HPD. Uh, I believe this is, uh, what is this, West Side Patrol? Yes, West Side Patrol. We're out here, 7700 block of Riptide, folks, right off of uh, West Parkway, West Park Tollway. See if I can get some more visuals. Oh, look, they're coming through. I guess we, I'm going to walk over there. Let's go see. I think they're going to be walking this way. We'll go see, friends. <clears throat> there is no longer any threat to the public or anybody else. Hey, how are y'all doing, friends? 
Yes. ¿Cómo están? <coughs> Where is it? Vaya. All right, we're gonna we're gonna go over here. Looks like it was a house. What's up with it, honey's peeps? How y'all doing? Thank God it ended with nobody getting hurt, man. Because these situations, far too many times, we see that we see the opposite. This could have had a different outcome, you guys. <clears throat> oh my gosh. The sidewalks here are dangerous. I do want to add on a side note. Look. And it's so dark over here. Oh, look, look. Look at this, wow. This is what the scene was looking like. Jesus. This is seashore and riptide. Hi, how are you? Grizzly's Hood News. Hey, how are you doing, sir? Hey, what's up with it? All right, Hood News peeps. <clears throat> Look. All right, we're out here, friends. Hood News repping. 77. I don't even know what the name of this neighborhood is. I just showed up. Look, they had bought out the toys, y'all. They had bought out the toys. What side patrols in the house? Right off of West Park Tollway. West Park Tollway. I got got here through via West Park Tollway. Let me show you guys where we're at. Look at that, man. That's so cool, man. Look at that. That's that payao. <laughs> Look at that. Is this a leaf, you guys? Am I an a leaf? What's up, Evelyn? She says she's here. Is this a leaf, y'all? Yeah, this is a leaf. What's up? Shout out to a leaf. We made it out. We got a rep for a leaf. Hood news out in a leaf. West Side Patrol on the scene. Um, barricaded individual. Uh, there have been some kind of a uh, domestic. All right. And there they go. They're not playing with y'all. HPD is not playing. They were able to keep everything under control. Yeah. All right. Thank you to the men and women of law enforcement. Look at those. Look at all those fishing poles on that thing. They're ready to go fishing. Yeah. Thank you. All right. All, right. all the way out in A Leaf. It's your girl Grizzy. HPD is uh, leaving the scene, suspect in custody, kids and women are, are safe now. Uh, there was an assault on a lady, man barricaded himself, shots were fired on his part when law enforcement arrived. A lot of peeps started alerting me about this, <clears throat> so we had to pull up. All right, reporting live is your girl Grizzy, back to you, A-Leaf. This is a uh, Riptide. All right, everything's good to go, you guys. Everybody can finally uh, pull out the neighborhood or go in, whatever. 
because it was closed off, you guys. Be safe, you guys. <clears throat> Look at all the resources that had to come out. But they do this to keep everybody safe. Hey, what's up? How y'all doing? What's up? Hood use peeves. Hey. West Side Patrol's in the house. Girl, take your SPM shouting out. Girl, really? Man, go go somewhere else with that. Not right now. This ain't the time. I I I I don't do the bopping thing. We don't ride nuts, y'all. Bye, good night, y'all. Be safe. Thank you for all you do. Bye, mamacita. Y'all be safe. Uh, yeah, we don't bop like that, y'all. You, If you're a rapper bopper, uh, there's other pages for that. <clears throat> if they're actually doing something for the community, then cool. But we don't, we don't, we don't do all that. We're not groupies. <laughs> for real. Yeah, she tripped out. <laughs> I hope she's gonna be all right. I did her the favor, but by deleting her comments so that nobody, you know, messes with her. I gotta look out for my girl too. She's just crazy. That's all. Y'all let her slide. She cray cray. <clears throat> Reporting live out here in Ailey. If it's your girl Grizzy, back to you, friends. Vamos a la chingada.